Mike Tyson in the black trunks against Trevor Burbick, the big Canadian, also in the black trunks, long black socks. Round one of a scheduled 12 rounds at his side, the destination of the WBC heavyweight champion of the world. And Mike Tyson has shown so much promise in his professional career, and this is his first tilt at a title. And he's taking on a big fella here, big right there, gaining through from Burbick, and a lovely right to the body also. And Mike Tyson has got huge hopes of all future fight fans on his shoulders and he needs a big win here and lovely uppercut there again from Trevor Burbick Tyson just 19 years of age Trevor Burbick comes into this fight, 32 wins, only five defeats, reigning WBC champion. Oh, and again, big punches here over the top from Tyson, both hands. Burbick though standing up resolutely so far. And uh, worth remembering that uh, Trevor Burbick was the man who ended the career of Muhammad Ali. A fight really that Ali should never have taken. Also a terrific 15-round uh, points defeat at the hands of Larry Holmes. So the former Commonwealth champion then defending his world title here. Big uh, left hook swipe there from Tyson. A lovely right. And all of a sudden Burbick in big trouble here in round one. This is scheduled for 12 rounds and Trevor Burbick is having to stave off some fierce looking punches here from Tyson. Tyson absolutely impervious here to anything that Burbick wants to try and that's a cracking round for Mike Tyson. Canadian champion, former Commonwealth heavyweight champion. The man's been around. So a bit of replay then from round one, and that's a lovely right there from Tyson. Followed up by a very, very swift left hand. Overhead shot. Burbick pokes out the jab, but takes a lovely right over the top of it. And that's a move that Tyson's been working on, knowing that Burbick will come forward with the jab. Into round two then of a scheduled 12 rounder. And Mike Tyson looking to win his first professional championship. Lovely right there. And Burbick in all sorts of trouble now. Right at the start of round two on the floor here. In the second round, right at the very beginning. Well, Burbick there trying to convince referee Mills Lane he's okay. But Tyson has got Burbick in his sights now. Big left hook again and Burbick once again wobbles. Tries to hang on. Mills Lane, just a small man, separating them. And Mike Tyson has got that steely, cold glare in his eye. And Burbick, well, he looks like a very worried man, doesn't he? And Tyson, absolutely destructive. Trevor Burbick, more than 10 years older. But Tyson looking as fresh as a daisy here. And 
And who can blame Trevor Burbick for trying to hang on and get a bit of uh, breathing space so he can clear his head. And Tyson, the biggest draw in boxing today. Oh, a lovely couple of punches there again, and he's got uh, Trevor Burbick once again in a bit of bother here. And the Canadian does the right thing, just hangs on for a moment. Well, Tyson just wrestling his way on the inside there, looking for the right moment to unleash an attack here. And that's uh, a punch, really, that uh, Tyson's wasted over the, uh, the course of the first round, really. The jab, very important punch, that. Oh, short left hook, and he's got him! The left hook landed on the forehead there, and Burbick, in a delayed action, went down. He's in big trouble. Goodness me, he's all over the place here. And he's breakdancing all over this ring, Trevor Burbick. And Mills Lane knows it's too late. So, a fantastic second round stoppage victory there for Mike Tyson to become the WBC heavyweight champion of the world at the expense of the former champion. In his first defence there, Trevor Burbick absolutely destroyed in two rounds. A short, sharp left hook to the forehead was what set up Burbick's downfall. Well, the reign of a very destructive champion has begun. Only time will tell, of course, how far Mike Tyson can go. Burbick dethroned, beaten, early, conclusively. Here we are then, bit of replay from the second round. Lovely right hand there, and Burbick almost broken in half by that punch. And there's the follow-up as well, two thumping punches to the, uh, the jawline. And there, down he went. Well, the right hand caught him on the forehead. He floundered like a fish out of water on the canvas. And that's that left hook again. As I say, it was a delayed reaction there you saw from Burbick, and he fell flat on his shoulder blades. And that is incredibly disorientating, as you can see here. He skipped and fell, got up again, reeled, wobbled and rolled all over the place. And uh, Mills Lane had already made up his mind by this point that Burbick was going no further. He might have picked up the count, but that was not the point. He knew. Just watch this again. The short, sharp left hook on the, temp on the forehead was the punch that set him off. Bang. And he just momentarily stood there motionless and then toppled like a tree in the woods and landed flat on his shoulder blades. And you can almost hear the front row audience shouting timber as Trevor Burbick keeled over. And that is very, very disorientating. As you can see, absolutely all over the place and it doesn't come much more conclusive than that does it stops the bout at two minutes 35 seconds of the second round the winner by a TKO and youngest and new WBC heavyweight champion of the world